All right, pre-algebra students, here's a quick little video to help you with your IXL practice today. So I've got IXL open. I'm going to go to our first skill for today, which is HUR. And remember, you're going to need a calculator to help you today. So either go ahead and split screen with your calculator like I'm going to do or have a handheld calculator in front of you. So for the first part of all of the IXL practices today, you're going to do the same thing we did yesterday where I showed you how to use your calculator to put in the scientific notation. So I'm going to enter this exactly as it appears on the screen. So I'm going to open parentheses and then five times 10 to the fifth. So remember to get that power. It's your A to the B button on this calculator. Remember to arrow over before you close your parentheses. And then we're adding, open parentheses, 3.9, forgot my decimal point, times 10 to the fifth. Okay, arrow over, close parentheses. Okay, so one tiny difference from yesterday. Yesterday we were just writing whatever appeared in your calculator. Today, notice the directions say add, write your number in scientific notation. So you have to do one extra little step. So you wanna be thinking about um, if my answer is 890,000, that's my answer in standard form. So how is that gonna look in scientific notation? So remember, I would need to move the decimal right after the first digit. So it is going to be 8.9 for the first number, which deletes. That means I can eliminate the first answer and the last answer choice because 7.2 is not part of my answer. So I just need to figure out is my power 10 to the 5th or 10 to the 10th. So when I look at that number, I want to think about how many times would I need to move the decimal point to get it right after the 8. So looking at this number, I have five digits after the eight. So therefore, the correct power is going to be 8.9 times 10 to the fifth. So I'm going to choose that answer and then submit it to show you that that is correct. Okay, so that's how you're going to work the IXL practice today. I'm going to do one more. So we'll just go to multiplication for something different. So the next skill is YZU. So this one is multiplying numbers in scientific notation, just to show you that we're going to do exactly the same thing. So I'm going to open a new tab here. So we have um, open parentheses, 3 times 10. Oops, my calculator is doing that weird thing again. To the first arrow over. Close parentheses, and we're multiplying. Now, notice they don't show a multiplication symbol in between. That's because when you have two sets of parentheses right next to each other, you're multiplying. So you can you can go ahead and put it in again exactly how it appears on your screen is fine. And this one is 10 squared, arrow over, close parentheses. Okay, so again, for this answer, my um, standard form answer is 9,000. So to get that number between 1 and 10, I want my decimal right after the 9. So all of these show 9 is my whole number, so the first part of these is all correct. I just need to figure out which power of 10 do I need. So again, how many times am I going to move that decimal point? So from all the way at the left, moving it before those three zeros, that means my power of 10 is 3. So the correct answer choice is 9 times 10 to the third power. Okay, so there we go, friends. Um, please take your time with these. Remember, the most important thing is entering them in your calculator correctly. And then if you need to use some additional paper or whiteboard to practice changing them back into scientific notation, please feel free to do so. And I'll be back to answer any questions that you have soon. Hope you have a great day.